Welcome to Morning Announcements, I'm James Duff. For the NAFCS fishing team, please send your completed entry forms and money to Mrs. Mayfield right away. Attention seniors, completing the FAFSA free application for federal student aid is a crucial step for unlocking financial aid opportunities for your education in Indiana. Starting with the graduating class of 2024, completing the FAFSA is mandatory whether college bound or not. The FAFSA opened doors to grants, scholarships, work study programs, and low interest student loans. Join Mrs. Baker's Flex this week to participate in a student-led Valentine's Day themed art workshops. All students are welcome, but there are limited spots. Spanish Honor Society will be offering free Spanish tutoring sessions and homework help for levels 1 to 3 tomorrow after school. No appointment necessary. Also, the a cappella students are going to Rome will be hosting a spaghetti dinner this Saturday, February 17th from 4 to 8 p.m. at the local Tunnel Hill Christian Church at 5105 Old Georgetown Road. Carry out or dine in. Interested in joining the Floyd Central cheer team? Join us for open practices every Tuesday from 4 to 6 p.m. in the cheer room. The winter ball is an all-school dance on February 24th. Tickets can be purchased online or at lunch on the 22nd and the 23rd. Students must present some ID at the dance check-in. If you have not pre-ordered your 2023-2024 yearbook, you've only got two more weeks to get it for $65. The cost will increase to $70 on February 17th, so don't wait. You can order it online today. Purdue Polytechnic New Albany will hold our Spring Open House on Tuesday, February 20th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. Students who are interested in earning a Purdue University degree can get a first look at all we have to offer. Students will learn more about our Bachelor of Science degrees in Mechanical, Electrical, and Industrial Engineering Technology. St. Mark's Church is holding a Neighborhood Health Fair on February 24th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. And invitations to apply to the National Honor Society will have been emailed to all qualifying juniors. Juniors interested in applying to NHS will need to check in for their email application instructions. Applications are due March 8th by 3 in the room C107. Unified Track will be having tryouts on February 27th at 5 on the track. Also, there will be a Floyd Central Book Club meeting where they will be reading Cersei by Madeline Miller as their next novel. The next meeting is the 29th of February in Mrs. Schroeder's room. All are welcome to join. Floyd's Knobs Elementary is looking for volunteers to help run their stations at their Reading Rodeo on March 1st from 5.15 to 7.15. And counselors visited all senior English classes regarding their future plans. Every senior needs to sign up and complete this form and turn in your counselor. We would like to see and recognize every senior, even if you don't know what your future plans are. This form is due no later than April 5th. Please see your counselor if you have any questions. For sophomores, those for sophomores, those completing a process or intent to enroll form can begin doing so. Forms must be submitted by March 1st. A link and instructions have been posted to the Class of 2026 Google Classroom. If you have questions, please see your counselor. Also, sophomores, the next-gen applications are now available. For the link, see the Class of 2026 Google Classroom. Participants will take part in a philanthropic project that will heighten their knowledge of a particular not-for-profit, build their collaboration network, and provide the opportunity to execute a physical and financial benefit to the community. All are welcome to apply. The SIU is looking for kids that would like to play soccer. All levels are welcome, and the FC Outfitter store is open during lunch on Mondays and Fridays. Anyone interested can pick up a driver's education packet in the bookstore. And finally, extended days in the Media Center every Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday from 2.30 to 5.30. There's a math teacher in there every day, an English teacher on Monday and Tuesday, and a science teacher on Thursday. That's been your morning announcements. I'm James Steff. Have a great day.